Ladies and gentlemen, make sure you are following us on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. Give us a five-star rating. It massively helps us out. Enjoy. We touched on it a little bit earlier, but I wanted to do the reverse side of the coin. We spoke about how Newcastle could benefit from James Madison. Leicester City, big trouble. Mm, ropes for them, man. Do you think they finish in the top half of the Premier League this year? They stink. Surely not. <laughs> they stink. <laughs> if, if, there's, there's if, ja- if James Madison actually does go, but these lot are in a world I, of trouble. I completely agree, because if, if he goes, they also are potentially looking at losing for Fana as well. Chelsea are coming. Chelsea are sniffing like, around. Yeah, they're, they're just they're, they're ripping the spine out of that Leicester City. And side. Schmeichel as well, right? And Schmeichel. Schmeichel yeah, Schmeichel's like, he's already it, it, it gone looks, to Nice. It looks almost nailed to if, happen. I'm pretty is it? Sure. It is Nice. Yeah, yeah. It? it is Nice. Yeah, yeah. If your keeper right is like because this has happened quite late. Like why wasn't this sorted like after the season? Why wasn't it organised? Like he's been there quite a long time. Usually yeah. with a, like a player like that, they'd be like, oh, Captain. yeah, exactly for the for the title winning. Years, oh, and I think Wes Morgan was, but yeah. like, but they they they'll be like, oh, like with two games to go, they might be like, oh, I'm leaving at the end of the season. He's literally been in yeah. pre-season and went, ah, oh, fuck this shit, like I'm I have to leave, like, and that should be if he's the captain, that is like got to surely rock that all change. That room. is actually a very good point that I never considered. Yeah. Like there was no indication that he was going to leave at the end of for the season. for a player like, of exactly. that, like yeah, like, like, like yeah, team. important. And yeah, it's almost just like, not, not like a respect thing to the club, but you'd think they they probably have like a really good working relationship and yeah. he, he you'd like to think that he'd be able to, maybe at the end of the mm. season, go, by the way, I'm looking for a new challenge, yeah. blah, blah, blah. But yeah, you're right. Like what, Sorry, he's just rocked just up. to the south of France. <laughs> f- fuck all. But, and, and by the way, like, let's be honest, like, that's a step backwards. Oh, right? Kendrick, he might, so, so from, what, from why though? Why though? It's not, it's not like Leicester have gone and signed some insane keeper and now he's there like, I can't I, be asked yeah. competing for my spot. Yeah, here. I don't know the, I don't so know So why, ha- why, one, why is he leaving? And two, they're fucked in, mm. in, in that position if I, they don't sign well, someone. I, I, I think it just reflects the ambition of Nice because I've just been informed that uh, Aaron Ramsey signed yesterday for them too for Nice yeah so they're looking they're looking for that league and title charge is he on 400k a week there (laughs) as well it it might that actually might be an influence if Casper's getting way more money at that club but I've heard that Leicester fans have been like a few of them have been saying Casper Schmeichel hasn't actually like when we think of Casper Schmeichel you think of like the title win season like amazing really good and then the season after really good but even in the Euros mate yeah Ridiculous. But some Leicester fans I've been like reading saying that he hasn't been performing at that level for like last season or the season before, probably reflected in the form and everything. Might be to do with due with the defence or whatever. But maybe it's actually he's not, on a decline. Yeah, maybe it's not actually as big of a thing as we think it is. Mm. Fine, but then where's your replacement? Like, are you seriously telling me like Ward now is number one for Leicester? When yeah, when, it's, when, it's when, tough, when, when 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 season a couple of seasons ago they're they're challenging top four yeah that's insane and they bottled it twice yeah, yeah, yeah. back to back bottles yeah and now they just lost their keeper and there's not a keeper in sight they're, they're, well and potentially their star man <laughs> maybe they do have, maybe maybe we're just talking absolute waff here because like they that's could actually do. have they might not but they, but they might actually have someone literally like they say right you go don't worry we've literally got someone yeah. so it could just be an in and out yeah yeah i also think like jamie vardy is 35 now <laughs> Like the, he was, <laughs> like the, he, he, he can't do anything. Like he, like it, his things pace, and now he's thirty-five. Like he's kind of fucked. Um, so I just think like their whole team was built around him in behind. You know, like people couldn't handle it. Yeah. Whereas now is their striker uh, Iggy Nacho? Yeah, uh, yeah, and, and Daka. Yeah, and Daka. But, and they, I, they, but that's another conversation. Yeah. Like, make your mind up. <laughs> yeah, 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 it's true. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I just think. It's so sad because Leicester are actually such a class club, and I just think they've been. I'd hate to take cha- take James Madison off them. Boom! They're such a great club, but uh, what a great club! Yeah. yeah, hope you enjoy playing with Burnley next season. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Newcastle are going to be so heated. <laughs> yeah, you re- lot. Are- yeah. <laughs> you, you just you, you have to like enjoy a, it. A money bully. That's what it will yeah, be. Yeah, we just like, have to live in like. Oh, the you kind of- really enjoy having yeah. him in your club. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Like, oh, He's going to sit on our bench. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the exactly Man City where the money way. Go as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's interesting Let's... as well because we've discussed a lot of players that are potentially leaving. And the one that I'm most excited for possibly leaving Leicester is Yuri Tiedemann to Arsenal. Who is, we're that, sti- is that we're happening? Still, we're still linked with him. But, but you've been linked with him for but ages. That's, that's, the Arsenal, that's the Arsenal transfer saga that we're used to 
where it goes f- for three months and then on transfer deadline day we go right we actually want to get this deal done boom oh so do you do you th- so do you think, think he, 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 do you possible. think the deal happens end of this end of this window do you think he goes um it's an Ozil if, job if, if if not many people leave Leicester before the end if Madison goes he defo don't <laughs> no, exactly exactly yeah. yeah but I mean if, if Madison stays Fafana stays I think Tiedemann's could go yeah 100% I don't but they can't you, you can't get rid of you can't get rid of keeper yeah. centre back centre mm. mid basically second Ten. striker that is an entire spine of the team. Can you yeah. imagine Look the traffic coming out of like their training ground on like deadline day? Oh my oh. god! <laughs> Everyone just walking out with the brown box. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so- sorry, lads. Dewsbury Hall, mate. You're you're now our main guy. It's got a niece. Barnes could do without getting injured. He mm. has been injured though. Yeah, but he, this is what I mean, yeah. this is what I mean. Like he is. He's. I remember there was. He had a bit of a purple patch. He Always. was on Mate, the, fire. Leicester, Leicester, Leicester is players. like that. Yeah, Leicester. Madison players, as well. Hundred mm. percent. They're just they're a purple patch team, man. And so yeah, I wonder if it is it is like a Leicester thing. Like if James Madison that goes somewhere else, is is it a thing where is he j- he's just on on fire yeah, yeah. or just playing at his best all the time, yeah. or is it a you know or or is he genuinely just a hot and cold player? And it's interesting you say that because <laughs> our final point of the show, yeah, is. Football conspiracy. Ooh, Ooh. Okay. That's a pretty good one. Is James Madison a completely purple patch player or is he capable of having a consistent season? Don't know. Can I just say, okay. you <laughs> were saying Newcastle should be 60 million. Now he's like, I don't actually know if he's good all the time. <laughs> no, no, I, no, I, I, I'm he's, sorry. He he's, yeah. he's, he's slots into your side. Yeah, 100%. You, that's an improvement. Regardless of yeah. what you say, he's better than Miguel <laughs> Almiron. He is better. So, than the, and he's he's doing really well. In he pre-season. is. Yeah. 